Arms, arms for the poor. Pray grant mm. that... Well met, Sir Arisen. Might I trouble you for arms for the poor? Many thanks. May fortune smile upon you. Well met, Sir Arisen. Might I trouble you for arm? Many thanks. May fortune smile upon you. Ah, hold on a moment, Sir Arisen. Perchance you would be willing to aid me with another matter. You see, one of the children we care for here at the Gracious Hand has gone missing. Malcolm, his name is. He's a steady lad. I can't imagine he would have run away. This building's very old. It could be that he's found himself in some strange corner of it. Might I impose on you to search for him? Gathering clues will be essential to our success in this matter. Malcolm's been really into exploring of late. Just the other day, he was going around telling anyone who'd listen about how he was an ox hair away from making some big discovery. I'll gather this. It might be of use. Malcolm? All he's doing of late is picking through rubble. Don't know why he bothered. Is... is Malcolm all right? We were supposed to go exploring together. But I overslept, and he went without me. Wish he'd woken me up. I was really looking forward to going down into those vaults. Oh no, I wasn't meant to tell anyone that. I suppose we'll be wanting to report back now. these vaults exactly. Let us return to Sir Kendrick. A chance he will not. Vaults, you say? By my knowledge, they were sealed off. Ah, but you mention rubble, aye? Then perhaps the lad found a way through. Come, I fear there's not a moment to look. Pray, follow me, and quickly. I believe this is the place to which... Look, there, a hole. Could he have passed? There is naught to be done but have a look for ourselves. The passage ahead looks small, but we may be able to squeeze through... Let us make haste. Come to think of it, was there not another task we were to see to somewhere nearby? When the mind is split, the heart must lead. Oh, so I've learned. I can scarcely see a thing in this murk.
ready? Bother. I was just getting warmed up. Malcolm, thank goodness you are unharmed. You have my eternal gratitude, Sir Arisen. Now I can breathe freely at last. Sir Kendrick? You'll never believe what I've found. Books, sir. Books, books, and more books. It's like some sort of secret workshop. Truly. Perhaps we ought to take a look. We ought not lose sight of our guide. This is no great shock to me. Above. Isn't it amazing? And I found it. Me. Tis quite a find indeed. Is this some manner of archive? Why, I've ne'er seen so many books. This collection must be worth a fortune. Tis a veritable treasure trove of wisdom. Might I ask that you not share the existence of this place with others, Sir Arisen? We cannot allow the knowledge accumulated here to be misused or mistreated. We ought to entrust its care to someone worthy, someone who can appreciate its true value. Pray, tell me if you know of such an individual. As for you, Malcolm, I forbid you from telling anyone else about this place. It will be our little secret. Understood? Oh, but... However, in exchange for your silence, you may come and go as you please. Let's investigate this place's secrets together, eh? It near boggles the mind that so impressive an archive slumbered here. I'd hasten so home, were this not my duty. Now I've gone and stepped in it. Well? Have you found some place I might sate my scholarly curiosities? Oh, to think such a place existed. How oh, very curious. Guide me outside, then. If you can deliver me from this pit, I ought to be able... 